Ну, бой! with how I dress or how I do my hair or you just kind of like to change your style a little bit don't you and I feel like I'm on the cusp of doing that uh, again at the moment so um I kind of went shopping and I thought I would share it with you so these are from Boohoo and Pretty Little Thing um so let's just get cracking shall we oh uh, whoa 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 actually before we start, you know what I'm going to say, don't you? If you are a returning subscriber, then welcome back. Thank you very much for coming back. If you are not, if you are just one of those people who watches my videos but aren't subscribed, that's why. What's that about? Go and just subscribe, then it's just there. It's already there. You don't have to go and do anything. Don't even have to put your big coat on. Just go and subscribe, please. Thank you very much. Right. Are we all subscribed? Are we in? Are we comfy? Are we sat down? Are we going to drink? Are we going to snack? Let's crack on, shall we? With the first item. <gasps> okay, so this is from Boohoo. And I know the irony that this is from the tall section of Boohoo. But I just like my jumpers to be a bit too big for me. <laughs> so there we go. But it's more I like them to like be cut like too long or too like wide or whatever. It's not that I just want a bigger size but to my proportions. I actually want it to be far too long. So I like to go into like tall sections for t-shirts and jumpers. So there we've got a cute little sweater with like the different colored bands on the arms and the v-neck. It's a bit of a cricket jumper, let's face it. Um, but yeah, I really like that one. And it is so super, super soft. Um, so this is, um, it doesn't say. I was going to tell you the prices, but it doesn't say. So there we go. But that one's from Boohoo. And I just thought that with a pair of jeans and a nice little heel would just be really simple, but look really cute as well. So yeah, it looks up. Okay, next from Boohoo as well, I've got this burgundy t-shirt that says goddess on the front of it. And I mean, that might come across as really narcissistic and up myself, but Paul does refer to me as his goddess. So, you know, kind of a bit of a nod to that. One, another another point is it's in my favorite color burgundy so why would i not and three why can i not think of myself as a goddess we all are let's face it so yeah i got that one and that's just a really simple t-shirt there with you know again jeans and heels or a little skirt um i am thinking oh, i was gonna wear this today actually with my little one of my little mini skirts um so i might do that at some point in the week but yeah early that I think this is another Boohoo as well. Let me just check. Yep, this is Boohoo as well. And this I'm really, really excited about. Just go, just come with me on this one. Obviously, it's flipping neon pink for a start. What more is there? Um, but it's look at it. I'm gonna have to stand up to show you the whole thing, and I can't even get the whole thing in shot. It is a jumper dress. I used to wear these in the 80s and I really, really love them. It's so nice and soft. Oh, pair of tights, heels. Mm, just cute AF. I love this. I really, really like it. I can't wait to wear it. <laughs> just so cosy as well for like just, just, just around the house. Just getting comfy around the house or going out for a pub lunch or just, you know, down the shops or something. It's just comfy. Elixa. This, I think, was a pretty little thing one, and I'm gonna have to take it off the hanger because I'm gonna be, this is gonna be a struggle to show you. Um, right, we've got a dress from Pretty Little Thing. Um, we've got kind of a, a polo neck situation going on there, and then 
is just um, a really, really nice kind of bodycon kind of situation um, and goes into the halter neck there. I love it. So it's got kind of the low back on it and it's just um, a gorgeous uh, mauve pinky purple colour, which I really, really like. Um, I was thinking of wearing this for Valentine's Day, but I think I've got my eye on another one in this pile for Valentine's Day. So yeah, I really like that one. And it's got kind of one little, little slit in the side there, which just makes it a little easier to walk in and it stops them riding up as well. I have learned over the years. <sighs> Oh my god, I'm having flashbacks. I used to have a dress that I used to wear for work. Um, and oh my god, that thing just as soon as you walked, just would creep up your legs and then walk to the tram station in the morning. Oh hard work. Difficult. Difficult. Tough times it was. Um, next pretty little thing again is this cute little jumper. It's a crop jumper. I cannot tell you how soft this material is. Obviously, we've got a grey jumper there. It's got a little bit of a V-neck, but it's not kind of a harsh V-neck. It's more rounded off at the bottom, so that's really nice and cosy, cash. Um, but the thing that I love about it is the kind of bat wing sleeve. It's got really wide sleeves that sort of go into a bat wing. Um, yeah, I just love that. That was some nice high-waisted jeans for me is like perfect and with um do you remember the baker boy hats i bought end of last year that one of them baggy jumper jeans oh, love it this is another pretty little thing one and it's a cropped hoodie uh and this time it's in this kind of stone color so it's got a really nice slouchy hood on it there um and says loyalty across the front which is a concept which is very, very important to me. I take loyalty seriously. Um, so yeah, I love that one. It's got a little bit of a cuff on the sleeves and it's sort of gathered at the bottom there with the string. It is quite cropped, um, but yeah, it's, so, it's just super, super comfy. So yeah, I love that one. So that again is Pretty Little Thing. Next, we're on to Boohoo um, and it's another jumper dress, but a hoodie one. Oh my God. If this does not get nicked off me, I'm going to be incredibly surprised because I know a certain someone who's already got their eye on this. So again, massive slouchy hood. Love it. And it is just the straightest cut. No hems, no cuffs on the sleeve, but I love it. It's like just the comfiest jumper dress ever. I just think it's gorgeous. The only thing that could make it any better would be if it had pockets. That's the only thing that could make this any, any better. So yeah, I love that one. What a hangover outfit this would be. If only I still drank. This one is a pretty little thing one and back to being a little bit smarter and a little bit more dressy. We've got the leopard print satin blouse. I really like this one. So this one has got kind of the, um, I don't know if you can see it there, like the eye kind of cut out detail at the back there, which buttons up at the back of the neck. Um, it's got a really nice kind of rounded hem at the bottom um, and it's got a little bit of a V. Just a, not a very deep one and not a very wide one, but just a little bit of a V down there um, and a few buttons as well. And it is the nicest, silkiest satin ever. It's gorgeous. I am obsessed with anything leopard print. I am all over. When Khloe Kardashian said leopard print is my nude, I couldn't have felt that more in my soul at all. Um, so yeah, I like that one. Next, and I think these are pretty little things. Yeah, these are pretty little thing as well. Oh my God. Check these bad boys out. These are bright pink for suede effect flared trousers. I cannot even, I cannot even. I am so excited. These feel so soft and nice. Honestly, the texture is incredible. I cannot wait to wear these. These are so cute. I love them. Um, they've got a bit of a side zip action going on there. Oh, I love them. I really love them. Oh, not sure what I'm going to wear these with yet. Maybe a white t-shirt or a black top. Um, either. 
I do have a sparkly sequin silver top that I think would go rather nice. Look. And these are Boohoo, but are a very, very, very similar texture to the last trousers. So again, they're that suede, sort of faux suede, just so soft and they're incredible. So these are, again, just some um, houndstooth check. Um, they're not houndstooth, they're just check. No, they are. They've got some little bits of houndstooth on there. Um, check trousers, very, very on trend for 2018. So hopefully they're still on trend in 2019 because she's going to be wearing them. Um, but yeah, just gorgeous. And these are more kind of legging type stretchy waist situation um i have endometriosis so sometimes my tummy just swells and gets really bloated really easily for whatever reason it fancies really um so something with an elasticated waistband is like perfect because some days um i just end up living in leggings because it's more comfortable around my midsection but I still want to dress nicely and I still maybe want to dress up a bit more than just leggings. So I love that these are a bit smarter and look a bit more dressed up and jazzed up. But I've still got that stretchy kind of waistband for the days where I'm a little bit more tender in that area. So yeah, I love them. Oh my God, wait till you see these. These are so cute. I think these were boohoo. No, these were pretty little thing. Let me check. Let me check. Where's the label? Oh, you're there. These were prettylittlething.com. Um, oh my god, I can't even. These are so cute. I've already flipping well got pink coin dungarees. Look at them. Look at them. They're so cute. Um, so we've got like the corduroy situation. Um, the the straps cross over in the back, which is so cute. They've got ruddy pockets. What more could I ask for, really? And they're the baggy kind of culotte but full length um, dungaree experience. I mean, and they're so soft. Like, seriously, whenever I've bought things from Primark or Boohoo or Pretty Little Thing for the past, like, 12 months, I reckon, everything is so soft. What is going on these days? <gasps> but yeah, look. The pink, for God's sake, the pink. Another, another set of trousers, and again, super happy about these. Again, for the endometriosis reason, these are elasticated around the waist, and they are high-waisted as well, so if you've any kind of, like, swelling or bloating issue going on, then get yourself some elasticated high-waist um, situations, because I cannot tell you the level of comfort you will experience. Um, so these are just incredible high-waisted burgundy ribbed um sort of like a corduroy effect but not quite that thick not quite that material it's a lot thinner than that um jersey trousers super baggy super soft and comfortable and i mean just look at that color that is gorgeous um so yes cannot wait cannot wait to try these and get going with these another pair of trousers very very excited and a very similar cut as well Hi. it's boo boo hell yeah he go so another pair in a very similar cut to the last one um but this is kind of less of a corduroy feel um jersey again i think um but a really nice kind of coppery brown um color to them and it's got a little bit of a shimmer running through the stitching as well uh, but just very very similar high-waisted straight leg baggy trousers <laughs> i'm just so excited sometimes feel like i should give a disclaimer at the beginning of my videos like how giddy i do get but then also i think no i'm gonna leave it a nice surprise if you don't already know <laughs> another pair of trousers oh, these are gorgeous these are a beautiful pair again of high-waisted baggy um you know if i'm having a bit of a blow today if my legs are painful i've had a lot of surgery on my knees and they swell so 
you know, if I'm having a swollen up day, if I'm wearing like skinny jeans or leggings and my knees are really swollen up and I, I get really self-conscious about them, like my dream is to have knobbly knees and I really don't have knobbly knees. I have swollen puffy knees and I hate them. So whenever they're really swollen and they're driving me insane because they're painful and they're swollen and I've then got skinny jeans or leggings on, and you can really see the swelling. It like really annoys me. So I feel like with like something a bit baggier, I can hide that and still feel like I look really nice and really put together and really stylish. And um, that might perk me up a little more. So yeah, so we've got those high-waisted, um, straight baggy-legged trousers, but these, where's the buckle? These have got a beautiful like tortoiseshell um, belt buckle to them as well, which I really love. I love the tortoiseshell, I love leopard print, any kind of browns, blacks, um, the different shades of brown, I love, so, yeah. Okay, you might be spotting a theme in a minute. Okay, so here, this one's from Boohoo. Um, all those trousers that I just showed you are from Pretty Little Thing. So this one is from Boohoo and I've got this gorgeous leopard print, um, little bit of a polo neck on it, but not like a high neck one, um, more of a turtleneck, um, bodysuit. Oh my God, I love bodysuits. Again, I used to wear bodysuits back in the 90s, early to mid 90s and Roddy loved them. And so I'm so happy these are back. And this is so soft again. I love it. So yeah. Got me a leopard print one of them bad boys. Uh, again from, this one's from Boohoo as well. And another body um, situation there. Um, this one is, if I can find it. Um, this one buttons at the back and it's got that keyhole kind of situation there. And again, it's a bit of a turtleneck. And this one is that kind of corduroy effect again, but it's a really nice soft jersey material with the white stripes down the sleeves. And I just think just look really simple and really nice. And I'll go with anything. I mean, you can dress it up, you can dress it down. Perfect. This one I think is my favourite. This is from Pretty Little Thing. And again, it's a bodysuit, very similar to the last one, but it's got the zip down the front and it's got the stripes on the inside of the arms instead of the outside. And oh my God, I cannot, cannot find the words to tell you how soft and comfortable this is. Like, incredible. I just get really excited when I get nice things. I mean, who wouldn't? Come on. I've got another bodysuit. This one is from Pretty Little Thing and is a little bit of an amalgamation of the last two. So it's the same kind of style as the first um, darker one that I showed you. This is kind of the ribbed corduroy effect, but the jersey material, um, but it's just plain black. Um, and it does have quite a low uh, V to it as well. And it's got like the turnover, like shirt collar almost. Um, so yeah, I love that one as well. Oh, Paul should be on his way now as well. <laughs> right, and then um, I think it's the last bodysuit. I think, but yeah. Um, so this one is your turtleneck um, wet look bodysuit, which I just think is absolutely beautiful. I love like a wet look legging or wet look trousers. Um, so yeah, pairing it with one of those as well, go for a full wet look effect or even just sticking a pair of jeans on with it or a skirt, a nice little pencil skirt or something. I just think it looks super effective. It's just an easy way to really dress an outfit up for a night out. I love it. Um, so yeah, I've got that one as well. Oh, was that boohoo or was that pretty little thing? This was a pretty little thing one. Okay, so this is the one I might wear for Valentine's Day. So let me know what you think. Um, so yeah, this is, I can't describe the material. It's so beautiful and soft. It's almost like bikini material. Do you know what I mean? Like that soft material. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's that. And it is just a little black dress. So it's got the very, very, um, subtle turtleneck to it um and just plain straight sleeves long sleeves to it little bit of a curve there so it's more of your body contact situation there um and it's just a really nice sort of mid 
um, mid shin length midi dress um, and I just think you just get a really nice simple one of these they're so effective and I love that it's a curvy one as well see it sits in all the right places so yeah this was from pretty little thing as well so I might this might win for Valentine's Day. I think we're going out for a meal, so I think it might be a bit more forgiving than the other Movi one for going out for a meal as well. And it's a little bit longer, so I feel like it'll be more comfortable to um, be sat at a table with. Um, but yeah, can very much do a restaurant and then maybe out for drinks afterwards. Um, but yeah, I just really like it. I just think as well, you need a nice, simple black dress or a black outfit because they are so easy to wear and so easy to dress up. If you've got like an unexpected night out or you're just not feeling it, stick on just a nice simple black outfit and it just, it will just go with anything. They're just easy to wear, they're just easy to wear. Right, we're on to the last two and I'm very excited. So these, these, oh I nearly got through a whole video without saying these instead of this. Ah. Oh! God's sake. Oh. Right, this is so comfortable. I'm saying it's so comfortable. I've not worn it yet, but it looks comfortable. Um, so this is just a nice padded puffer jacket and it's got the press studs up the front. I think there's a zip behind it. Yeah, it zips up. The collar is so like, um, not stiff, but just well padded. So I feel like once you zip it up around your face, it will be so cozy and warm. So yeah, I love it. So I've got a stone colored one, which I feel like would go with a lot of things. Like if I've got black on, or if I'm wearing like my browns or my leopard prints, or like my white t-shirts, this will just go really, really easily. However, I do also like a little bit of color. So on that basis, I got a purple one as well so I've got a beauty it's exactly the same style although I will say the collar on this one doesn't feel as firm and as like padded as the other one um so yeah it's just exactly the same style but it's in lilac so I felt like you know if I wanted a bit of colour or I've got like my little um you know the pink dungarees and I've got some glittery trainers with lilac uh, grey pom-poms on the top of it what a cute little outfit and I thought it would be really cute for going into spring, you know, and it's still a bit showery and it's still a bit undecided whether it's going to be warm or cold. There we go. Totally perfect for that as well. Okay, these are the last two. I thought they were the last two, but these were hiding underneath. <laughs> it's only a leopard print onesie. <laughs> Look at it! <gasps> and it's in that really nice, soft jersey material. <laughs> The only thing I struggle with um, is that the buttons only go sort of, where's the top one, there, the buttons only go about like six inches or so, like, hmm, I'm a bit concerned about getting my entire backside and thighs and hips into it up to like chest area gonna have to squeeze myself into that one um so yeah i'll let you know how it goes getting the curves into that but oh my god how cute is that that's from pretty little thing as well and then this one i had to have you all seen the logo for pretty little thing with the pink unicorns on it well they do the onesies and it had a hood on it look though it's like so cute so it's in the pink um unicorn logo for pretty little thing but it's a onesie so cute so cute i love it so much so I have worn this once um i'd struggle with some onesies like overheating in bed because they just get too thick and i'm like well i need to take it off but that one i can wear all night no problem because it is that kind of thinner um t-shirty jersey material so yeah i love that one and that was it. That was my um, pretty little thing and boohoo haul. What a haul it was. Um, I did also get some other bits like underwear, but I'm not showing you that. So there we go. Um, but yeah, I really, really 
feel now like I've got a really nice wardrobe and some really good choices of things to wear for like different occasions, different moods I'm in. I've not really been one for sort of buying lots and lots of clothes and like being interested in what I've got and sort of putting a wardrobe together as in different things that will create different looks and like pair with each other. Um, so I feel like the last couple of years I've really sort of done really well in getting some really nice pieces together and I feel like those have really really upped the ante and added to that and I can kind of switch up my style depending on what mood I'm in. So yeah, I love everything that I got there. Let me know which things you like. Let me know if you've got any of them as well. Which was your favourite and which do you think, yeah, that's the most Layla thing that you've got there? Yeah, let me know what you thought in the comments. Make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you've got your notifications switched on so that you are notified whenever I post new content. I do try and stick to a schedule, but I have two kids, a dog, two cats, a boyfriend, and I'm quite scatty, so sometimes I don't stick to the schedule so just you just might as well subscribe and, and click the notifications because it just might surprise you one day um so yeah I hope you've enjoyed it make sure you have an amazing day whatever it is you're doing for the rest of it remember I love you like this much and I will see you in my next video thanks for watching bye there's no boy <laughs> Stop.